Let me guess, I just gave away my position to something I didn't want it to. Oh! <laughs> what the hell? Hey there guys, Winnie here and welcome back to Let's Play Fallout 4. When last we met, we followed the Freedom Trail all the way to the end. These catacombs underneath, um, this place, uh, the oldest, uh, church in, uh, Boston. Found some ghouls who killed them. And then I encountered this puzzle, which, um, I could not figure out for the life of me because I didn't remember what all the numbers and letters were. But... I originally thought after the episode I was like oh it it's got to be um, something like freedom you just put in freedom but with all the uh, letters that you saw it was probably spelled out a little differently than just doing you know freedom but um, as it turns out it is actually a uh, railroad which is a uh, another good and obvious answer. Okay, and D. Hey, Railroad it is. How cool. Good lord! Who are you? Why don't you tell me who you are first? In a world full of suspicion, treachery, and hunters, we're the synth's only friends. We're the railroad. So answer my question. You guys are synths? Ooh, what? I followed the freedom trail looking for the railroad. I'm not your enemy. If that's true, you have nothing to fear. It's clear you're not with the Institute. But who told you how to contact us? Uh, Diamond City? I just heard a rumor about you guys in Diamond City. I see. I'm Desdemona, and I'm the leader of the railroad. And you are Deacon. Where have you been? You're having a party. What gives with my invitation? I need intel. Who is it? Wow. Newsflash, boss. This guy is kind of a big deal out there. Glad someone noticed, you know? You're practically famous. Des, seriously, you haven't heard of him? He's the leader of the Minutemen. It seems like the whole Commonwealth is flying his flag. So you're vouching for him? Yes, trust me. He's someone we want on our side. That changes things. So, stranger, why did you want to meet with us anyway? Uh, okay. Do we make this about me or about them? That's a, an interesting proposition. Now, synths are not really something to be hated, as we have learned. If we're done here, let me know. They're not really something that we should be fighting against. We should be fighting the Institute, because they're the ones trying to implant them in society and cover it up without being open and honest about it. I could do my son, though, and make it about me, but I don't know. Uh since I want to lend a hand there's a procedure for people who want to help the railroad and showing up unannounced isn't it hmm I followed the only lead I had well hopefully nobody else crashes this party if we're going to be dealing with you I need to make sure we're on the same page you know what a synth is right I 
I've heard rumors. What are they, really? The Institute created them. Synthetic humans. They're mostly organic, part machine. Somewhere along the line, they became more than just constructs. They think, they feel, and they act just like you and me. The Institute treats synths as property, as tools. That sounds like slavery. Exactly. So we seek to free the synths from their bondage. Give them a chance at a real life. I have a question. The only question that matters. Would you risk your life for your fellow man? Even if that man is a synth? Sure. Once, I pledged my life to protect my countrymen. I don't see this as any different. Well said. You said you wanted to save synths. But right now, we don't have the time to train up a new agent. There are, however, other valuable ways you can contribute. And in turn, we can help you. See Deacon for details. You're free to go. Hmm. Yeah, you guys don't make it a big secret to get down here. It's just a big red trail that leads through all of Boston. Hope you didn't mind the reception. When you tango with the Institute, you gotta be careful when someone new gets on the dance floor. Your leader was just being cautious. I'll take her feelings over becoming the Institute's plaything anyway. Exactly. Kind of killed our chance at a friendly first impression, though. But it's all good now. I vouched for you. Nobody got shot. Still, I would consider it a close personal favor if you didn't sell us out to the Institute. Thanks. So tell me, why did you vouch for me? I've heard a lot of things about you. Enough to want to give you a chance. So Des wants me to make you a tourist. That's what we call someone who helps out with the odd job here and there. What a waste. I'm just going to come out and say this. The railroad needs you. You got my attention. I got a job. Too big for me, just perfect for the two of us. You help me out, we turn a few heads, and then Des invites you into the fold. Then, if you get into a bind and need some help, your buddies in the railroad got your back. What's the job? So, up front, the only thing I'll say is that it's going to be a wild and dangerous ride, but probably nothing new for someone like you. Sign me up, then. Perfecto. Let's meet up at the old freeway outside of Lexington. I'll fill you in once you get there. Hmm. Okay. Got a real interesting place around here. Can't wait to get out of this place. Drummer boy. Ooh, boy. I cannot wait to make fun of you. Leave. I get to do a full security suite before you can get out of here, too. Oh, sweet. There's Demona. We'll file out separately after you leave. Best not to attract attention. So. This is it? This is. Okay. Never mind. I assume this is a meeting spot. I'm not going to assume anything else. Alright. Well, time to get out. So I step on some ghoul heads on my way out, don't worry about it. I'm just oh, getting lost and caught up in things. I almost forget we're in a church. So now we have a whole nother series of quests with the uh, Underground Railroad. Well, underground is a almost literal term, um, and never mind. Anyways, so they want to help synths, which I don't have a problem with. Synths are just, as she explained, they're like people, basically, that were created. Uh, except the people that created them want to use them instead of, well, basically letting them live life. If you create life, I think it's a pretty good rule of thumb that you should let that life live, not control it. At least that's what the world has shown us so far. In multiple different forms of entertainment and media. Either way. If you start a fight you can't finish, try putting away your weapon. There's a slight chance your opponent may forgive you. Interesting. I'm willing to bet that doesn't work on a super mutant. Uh, okay. So, Tradecraft is that one. Meet Deacon at the old highway. Clear Taffington Boathouse. Travel to Grey Garden. 
talk to Jack Cabot, find Nick Valentine, speak with Paladin Dance, give Sheffield Nuka Cola. Yeah, I still can't talk to the guy at the General Atomics Galleria because I just don't know yet. Revere Satellite Array. I can't see what the quest is there, though. Okay. Oh, wait. There we go. Whoa! Nice armor. It's pretty cool looking. I assume that is a full heavy set of armor for raiders. That's why it's talking about them in the tip. It's pretty cool looking. I would get that, but I'd probably trade out the helmet for something else. I like the whole trench coat feel of it. Reminds me a lot of uh, New Vegas. I can go through here, I think. Slocum Joe's Corporate HQ. That's not what I wanted to discover, but oh well. Man, my ear keeps popping and ringing and... I don't know what's going on with it right now. So what is this? Oh! You scared me! Speaking of synths. Gotta set them free. By blowing them up. I assume these are like synths uh, that they've got to have something wrong with them or they're working for the institute or something. Who's this? Uh, the institute pistols too. All those institute weapons that we found that one time. It's nice because they give ammo for the uh, everything else that I have that I want. So that's just a train station then. So no worries about that. Fucking super mutants, man. <laughs> they got me on edge everywhere I go. I was thinking about getting some mods. For Fallout 4, but I don't know. I feel like mods is always dangerous and tricky business because it's always a it's always a hit and miss on whether or not it's gonna screw up your game. And uh, I don't know. I don't want to risk it too much because I don't want to risk losing any kind of a. I guess you say any kind of progress I've made so far or anything like that, but I don't know. I might get some mods, who knows. As it stands right now though, I don't think I will. But like, uh, but like with Fallout uh, 3 and good lord. Let me guess, I just gave away my position to something that I didn't want it to. Oh! <laughs> what the hell? Ah! That's like Jumanji up in here. Get the fuck out of here, man. It's my worst nightmare. Where'd they come from? God, and these are just the hatchlings. Now I've seen the real ones. Like, the, the adult ones. That, that shit's scary, man. Jesus Christ. You're gonna scare my pants off, man. Oh, we got a ton of ammo for this thing. I better use it. 
So I assume there's more things to be afraid of in this place. This is definitely going to become a settlement once I clear it out. This thing doesn't do a whole lot of damage. Ah! Damn it, Piper. He's just in the corner, I guess. I can't even hit him. Build and activate a recruitment radio beacon. Ay, ay, ay. Alright. So, yeah, I'm turning this into a settlement. Just fine and all, but I just. I don't like it. <laughs> oh. Where's my combat shotgun? Where's my combat shotgun? Why do I have some of these things? <laughs> really odd. Wow! Suppressed, hardened, piercing, 10 millimeter auto silenced pistol, I assume is what that else is gonna say. I'm gonna do that. Piper, like that. Short combat shotgun, get rid of. It's a glow sided combat shotgun. That's a lot better my opinion. Let's see what's in here. Lots of ammo and a pipe pistol that I don't want. Oh, I'm still cucumbered. I assume it's because of something that I don't want. Like, why do I have a dog collar? Girded leather. I never put on that synth one, yeah. For some reason I still have that fucking... the power armor pieces of my thing. I'm just like, okay. What happened? Fiber, you okay? Psycho, I'll take. Cooking station. All right, we need to build a recruitment thing, right? Or this is crafting stuff. Mm, structures, right? No. Recruitment radio beacon, there we go. It'd be cool if I could put it, like, up on the roof. How about on the roof? Oh, I just realized I had that radio on. If I get copyrighted for that shit, I'm gonna be so mad. Mm, girl. There we go. That's where I like it. I don't know why, I just do. It's really cool up there. Okay, bear with me, guys. No, we're gonna die. Settlement. 
Cool beans. Although slightly useless. Review satellite array. I wonder why it wants me to go there. Is Preston Garvin really at Sanctuary, or is he not? And it's just pulling my dick. Because, I don't know. <laughs> Every time it tells me to go here, and then I come here, and it's he's not here. He's always somewhere else, and I'm just like, okay, whatever. 